<laughs> Say bye, Dad. I love you, buddy. Alright, let's hit it. Mom packed me the biggest bag known to man. <laughs> Dang, you're gonna dent the trailer me for Me and Chase have this one bag. <laughs> he brought a hoodie for every oh, single yeah. day. That's my OG bag. <laughs> It smells like a donut. It does. Bro, are you so excited, dude? You don't have anything underneath your legs. Dude, oh my gosh, I can like, you know, sit. Hey, if Mo gets a little, start getting a little touchy in the back, then I'm gonna come out here and, you know, lay out. Wait, I can't see Mo. We need better lighting. <laughs> Dang! Oh, <laughs> the poor neighbors. The neighbors had to shut their blinds right then. Three, two, one. Close to balance. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are ridiculous. <laughs> Haley, are you ready? I'm ready for what? The toes are shootout. <laughs> I don't know what you're gonna share with What? Can you guess where we're going On the 40 for the next 16 hours? No, we're going to the shootout. <laughs> <laughs> All right guys, so obviously we got this trailer not too long ago. We've drove it to Millbridge a few times, um, which is a really short distance. Drove it to Kyle's once, pretty short distance, but now that I'm driving 16 hours, we got six hours left, I realize this trailer sways really bad, like really bad. I've drove a lot of trailers before, and I don't know why, I don't know if it's the 28 foot, because I've, I've had a 24 for a long time, any car next to you like gets it kind of going like you know start to sway else. yeah i mean i assume the sway bars would help if i got some of those but if anybody has any brains to trailer knowledge please put in the chat what i need to do to this thing like legitimate suggestions for people who have had that problem and fixed it not just the first googled response because i already tried that <laughs> and it didn't help yeah, it said drive under 50 and that's not and that's happening. not happening. We're gonna get there in three days. Okay. <laughs> so and we have the weight distributed right. Yeah, oh yeah, before before that yeah. gets put move the move it forward, move it more forward. I've got toolbox all the way at the front. It's got all the bags, like all of our bags for at the front. The trailer or the car is right over the axles. It, if you saw earlier in the last video me loading it, it's right literally right over the axles, more forward than it is backwards. Mm -hmm. So I couldn't move the weight more forward. I, I'm not, I'm not real sure. Little subway break? Subway. Eat fresh. That's <laughs> Miller. He dropped his whole sandwich. <laughs> not the study. We haven't really said that I'm racing. Oh. Have we not said that you're racing? No. Nobody said I'm racing. Nobody, well Chase is racing if you guys didn't know already. This is kind of like his, his race a year that he always races because there's always someone out there who has a really good car and they want someone good to race it and that's when Chase comes into play. Um, he just pretty much shows up with his helmet um, and just pays for the entry fees and he gets to go racing. And I know he loves racing and I know he looks forward to this week. I would say weekend, but really a whole week and a half experience and just having fun. Being able to race micros against the best mi micro guys in the world. Everybody that's watching this video right now, do, do you remember this? Wait, Miller, Miller, do you remember this? Are you sure you're ready? I'm you ready. have everything. Yeah, I remember that. Do you remember? Yeah, I remember. Do you remember? Not my suit. <laughs> oh. Dude, I can remember your stuff and mine. Come on, come on. Mm, let's uh flashback real quick i have everything you have your gear what why are you putting that on me because you're the guy that forgets everything <laughs> mm, what happened i was washing my suit because it had dirt on it from last time i used it and i left it in the washer <laughs> and we left we were only 20 minutes away we could have easily turned around and grabbed it but instead it's sunday can't be overnight today gotta wait till tomorrow and i do have other suits but like I want to have my heat wave suit that matches my car and my helmet. But it'll be here Tuesday before we start racing. So at least that's okay. Oh. We arrived. We made it. Ah, my legs hurt, dude. My legs. They just feel like 
Mm, man, that was a haul. <laughs> I think that was, besides our trip, oh, driving. Oh, did I get too far back? Babe. Yeah, too far back, Chief. With that being said, see you in the morning. Peace out. It's happening, it's happening that we are getting in the building. We've been staying here for 10 hours. 10 hours later, we're getting our trailer in. We almost got here at dark and almost stayed out here till dark. Gosh, we'll finally be able to unload now and go get groceries and actually go get food. I still have any in today. Like, <laughs> oh, how am I supposed to leave? We're hooked up to a trailer in line. Miller's gonna pan over there nonchalantly. There's a crowd of people. Look. They just sit there and, and for the past 10 hours been watching every trailer that comes through. <laughs> All of a sudden, it's like the truck pulls away and they go, swarm in yeah, and you're like oh. dude we're trying to get like the trailer moved chase it's okay if you scuff it up on the bag he hit a tree last night shut up oh, oh. that's tight god He's got full coverage He's got insurance some some real talent now we gotta get unloaded 521 it's really been it's almost been 12 hours for me and Chase that we've been here. But I'm just happy, honestly, we made it inside the building. We thought if there was a strong chance that we weren't even gonna make it inside the building. We were gonna have to just pit with Kyle. But we got our setup here. We got everything we need, toolboxes, and it's nice having our own trailer because I bought a microwave and space heaters for the trailer. And so I wanna be able to utilize those things. <laughs> we're going to Walmart tonight to go get food. We need another table, get chairs, and a cooler, Chase, just some other stuff. Is uh, officially, I guess you could consider it day two, day one. Day one um, on the track, day two here. So uh, it's practice day today. Unfortunately, Haley and I are, we looked at the lineup. I go out and then she goes out back to back every single practice, stock non-wing, outlaw non-wing, and wing, uh, and A class. So it's uh, They did it. Dude, we, dude, we've been trying to get literally and we couldn't find the right ports and stuff so we needed some different connectors. Went to four different stores, couldn't find any. Found some that we think will work. Got it? What does it look like? Just move the whole box. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh my, what a savage. Why was no one smart enough to think of that? <laughs> I'm not an electrician. I think we're almost ready to go. Wings coming off the cars and I actually fit in the seat now because we got that seat made at the bottom. So I'm able to see high enough, no more hoodies. And then we took the ribs in also because there was about a four inch gap on the ribs and I have a permanent bruise now under my arms, but I think today's gonna be fun. We got six times to pay me and Chase that we're gonna be on the track. Back to back, only good thing about that is we'll be able to compare lap times if they have race monitor. done grinding the tires just getting that kind of glaze on them because they are new tires off but it leaves rubber everywhere everywhere look at the floor but we just want to get it all off the car so it's not on there all week because we can't really go wash the car you can only wipe it off we had the drivers meeting pretty much we're practice number 25 and 26 i believe we're 24 and 25 and then just kind of wait go off practice wait again practice again but me and chase are back to back so it's gonna make it like hurry up wait Hurry up, wait. <laughs> I just want to get on the track and drive. Just see like how it is, because I've never driven here, so I have no clue like what to expect with the track. Like I know what to expect based on what Chase has told me, but I don't know, I haven't driven here. I mean, I've driven here on iRacing in a midget, <laughs> but that's as close as I get. Oh, one Z. Chase didn't want me to be the first person out in practice because it like takes your car up, so we put a Z after our one, which would make me, because there's like, 21's here put me a little bit further back in practice. We're all ready to go. Our first practice of the day is about to start here. Chase is gonna be first. He's practiced 25, I'm 26, and it goes quick. We only get two laps now. They cut down our laps because it took so long to get everyone loaded in, so they're kind of on a time crunch right now. So they are cooking through stuff, but cars are all ready, so we're gonna get after it.
I watched, now. I, I understand. I got every. I got all the laps except the last one or the first one. Good. Because you went green and I was climbing out and I sprinted over. Good. It was actually faster. I did. I found it the last two laps. It's faster to go right now. Paul asked straight to the bottom of center one and mm -hmm. two, and in the center, cross to the top. Oh, like really? slide yourself. Yeah. And grab, dude. I did it. The last two, and it was like. Phew, yeah. Like, I felt like there was nothing on the bottom up four, up two. It was, it, it, that was one of the weirdest race tests. It was it's like, like, it should have been juiced up a little bit at least, and there was nothing. The, that racetrack was like, from that yellow line to that yellow line, and this was slick. Yeah. It was yeah. really weird. Yeah, it felt it's, weird. It's just I was very like, narrow. Chase, Chase didn't teach me what to do in this situation. <laughs> How did your car feel overall? Overall, honestly, pretty neutral. I, the first lap that you didn't get to watch, um, I ended up going in the slick in one and two, cause I just wanted to see what it felt like. I've never felt like what slick like, right. feels like. Right. I wanted to feel it and I was like, yeah, we ain't doing that again. <laughs> it's this much. If your right rear is here or here, literally. It's a no, difference. they no brought group. like legit the ice skating rink from North Carolina and Charlotte and put it on Tulsa. The dreaded weight of heat race lineups has come out. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. No, 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 that's why you've been so quiet for so long. Is there bad news? Not really. Okay. Out of both of us, I go first. Okay. I'm the fifth race tomorrow. I start second. Then you are race 24. Okay. This is your most stacked one, is tomorrow, not when we got So we're gonna call this class a dud. <laughs> Dude, that's, that's pretty, pretty sick. Yeah, yours is pretty rough. You know, for someone like me, who this is like my first big micro race, second micro race this year, I know those names. Yeah. So then they're really good. <laughs> so we literally have 100 races tomorrow until we go again. Yeah. Well, it give me time to reminisce if I did good or not in the stack class. So what, race 110, you're in this one. Trevor's in your ace. <gasps> Trevor's in my race! You're starting eighth. There's no I got a good chance here. You got a good shot in that. That's with a wing. Yeah. Of going forward to say fourth, third. And then that would, you would be give me good lying. points. Yeah. Mine, oh, I got to get off to a good start and, and get around. Uh -huh. And then Caleb, Caleb will be good. Doc non-wing, this is me. You're starting ninth. Starting ninth. Ooh, you're deep. Oh, Sheldon's in yours. Sheldon's in mine. KT's in <laughs> oh, mine. Oh, KT's in yours too? So I should be pretty good in that one. Oh. I'll be good in stock non -wing. Me. Your, your race, you start six. Okay. There's some pretty good ones. You should be fine. Is there one that like stands out? Over Batterby, Batterby for Batterby? sure. Yeah. They're fighting? They, They're fighting out, already? Some guy came out of the car and freaking went over, like, jumped out of the car, went over there and bolted to him, was like, hear him, but he was like pointing, and then the officials backed him up. Hell yeah! Dude, Fire it off early, son! Dude, the fight before we even hit the track, <laughs> fight after hot laps, like, dude, how much stuff can really happen in two or three laps? We can hang out a little bit, watch a few practices, and now it's time for our next practice, so we're gonna get after it. I'm excited because the track moved up to the top, now everyone's riding the top. So I think we're gonna go try a run up there, which I haven't yet, so that's gonna be interesting. Like the bottom had a lot of grip. You know, the only thing we gotta work on is that little bit of time that it took for you to, for me to say, hey, you gotta go. Because like if that happens at a heat race and you're just like, and I'm like. We haven't talked about when it gets, like when everyone's running the top, then all of a sudden they water. I'm like, I don't know what to do. <laughs> well, the bottom looked slick, but it had a lot more a lot grip. Yeah. Like I went down there and I, I like eased it off in there. And I like went in hard, and I was like, Burp. and I was like, oh shoot, yeah, the bottom got a grip. There, yeah. So that's what I was saying is like, you could be able to run hard down there. But like, you look good once I told you to go, mm -hmm. but like in a heat race situation, we gotta like, yeah, well, no, no, I know that, yeah. but. 
do I need to free the race car up, or would you? I like it, Tank. I like people that drive hard and straight into the corners. Now, I felt you looked good. Like, I don't want you to be down at all. Yeah. Like, you no. looked really good. Well, now that we're done with all the non-wing practices, it actually worked out perfect because wing practice is after all that. So now that we have the wing on, we gotta go try it out here. Obviously, I haven't driven with a wing at this track before, so it's gonna be practically like learning everything over again because you drive about 10 times harder with the wing on and you have a bunch more grip, as you guys saw at Millbridge, for those of you that watched our last couple of videos. So it's gonna be interesting here because I already feel like here this track has so much more grip and I feel like it's just hooked up. Even with a non-wing, it feels how Millbridge would feel like a wing. It's just the grip level was crazy here for practice. So I can't imagine how fast we're gonna be going with the wing now. <laughs> Last one of the night. Somehow we had five hours of downtime and we're still running. <laughs> long two days just like early to late to doing so much and I feel like we've done a good job to this point we got here drove 17 hours we got our trailer in after another 12 and we ended up being able to practice and made all of our practices even though we are always crunched on the hour for it so I'm gonna get thrown into a heat race tomorrow and hope it goes good <laughs> it's gonna be a whirlwind and a challenge but I'm up for it so we'll see how that goes but thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed till this point it's just gonna get better and more entertaining from here so we'll see you next one Give me all of your life.